Okay, game two against our very strong opponent. Oh, we could do Inventrix again. Let's take a look at the board here. Um, well, 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 well. Um, I think I like Inventrix over Thorgate here. Though, with Thorgate, we could open with Stronghold, which is something to do. This is a decent hand, but it doesn't have a ton to do. So I don't know if we value the... Um, oh, God, it's kind of tough. I kind of hate Stronghold, so I, I think I want to stick to my Inventrix guns here. Worst case scenario, we play Flooding. We could keep Search for Life. We could even keep Fungus. We are just so, so behind on development. It's kind of tough. If we keep this, we're at 24. So we're at a 20, so we'd have 21 cash, which means we could just like flood. Man, I don't know. The cards are just really good. We, I guess we could, we could consider giving up on Search for Life. Maybe that's best. I don't think I want to give up on any of these, though. Yeah, all right. Let's see what happens. Um, it's In a two-player game, I really like using flooding on our, uh, on our opponent. But we may be forced to... Um... Wow, okay. That was an awesome pickup. I can't decide if we take the two cards here or if it's better to uh Um I can't decide if it's better to take the cards now. I would put us at 17. Which means we would we would still have enough. Yeah, let's I think the cards are just too good. Let's take him. Oh my god. Now I wish we were Thorgate. I really don't like hackers, but um But you know, uh it's um it hurts in a two player game. So This is insane. The last th the, what he did last time was open with uh with with Phobos. Um okay, so I think I think better better than playing a standard energy into hackers. I think it is better to just play our development that we know is good cuz we might get, draw into energy. So let's do this. Yeah, see look at that. We got a uh, we got energy. And now we're totally out of money. So we have an we have an income of 4 compared to his income of 1, but we have a massive card advantage. So we're on pace to do another planner game, which is good. Um and then I think next turn, ah, pr of course private shows up right when I get hackers. Uh, if we're lucky, an ocean comes down, and we can we can consider getting hackers off that way. But uh, we'll see. Definitely a weaker start than last game. Probably not going to get forty cards this game. Wow, these cards are good. Um, specifically, these three for the time being. We could just play microbes right into hackers, and that's nuts. It it does really stink to pass him building industries, um, but we don't know if he has power. And if 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 we get trees as a consolation prize, that's probably okay. Mm, I don't really care about any of these. I, gosh, oh man, I think I'm gonna cut the ocean. <sighs> bad bad cards. Okay, so we could take the power i think we oof 
I think we have to take the power because we really don't want him to play that into um we want to make him work for power for the other card that he got so we can keep this one if we keep this we're at 22 and we would we, need, we only need 15 to get hackers down so the question is do we keep nuke power i feel like the answer is no because we're gonna get great dam going kind of soon and i don't think i want to take minus three it is a building tag though and if an oxygen bumper comes along that could be good Helps for planner. I don't know. I guess we could. That puts us at 19. Nah, I'm going to skip it. Because if he, like, sabotages us... I don't know. Let's just do it this way. Okay, we still have a massive card edge on him. Uh, and we are, we are going to hack him. Hopefully that slows him down a tiny bit. Science count is uh, in our favor. We have no no science to draw to, which kind of stinks. Solar wind. Uh oh. Okay, so he was able to get the power another way, which now is sad that we've we've passed him trees. But uh, let's hack him. And then we're done. And now we don't really have a plan. Um, other than try to get to planner, I guess. Nine to four, building is two to one, okay. Okay. Some great cards here. I think Restricted's the best. Because card draw is awesome. So I think he takes Dev Center here. And then we have to see... Um, yikes. Um, or Processor... I think we have to take no matter what, and we could re feasibly get it down with Great Dam and Space Mirror if it comes back, but this might force him to cut Space Mirror. I don't think we're too worried about Industrial Center Lunar Beam. Because now if, yeah, so he sent us back Space Mirror, so um, and now we can play the Oxygen game. And I like the Oxygen game, and it... It's the one that gives us titanium, and we have so many great uses for titanium. Let's do it. Problem with this line is um, we really need him to play an ocean. Could even keep all of them. If we keep all of them, we're at um, 21. There's, yeah, there's just no way we're getting on uh, or processor anytime soon. I guess we could just put our restricted over on Pavanus Mons, maybe. Maybe we skip this. Maybe the cash is better. We're so far ahead on planner. We don't like super have to keep it. It's just not even playable. Do we really want to go the or processor route? I think it's pretty good. We don't have any plant production yet, so. We might need it to combat a strong plant strategy, so let's do it this way. Okay, he's up to seven cards. Um, man, we could even be, we could even, we're, we're ahead economically. Let's stay ahead on the cards. Ho, 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 baby. Alloys. Okay, we need to figure out how to get some ore. And hopefully dodge his escarpment. Anthracite! Yeah, man! Thanks for the sub! Really appreciate it. 
Really, really appreciate it. Glad you're enjoying the, the games. Okay, so he takes Mohol, which isn't too surprising. Uh, Builder is tied at two. We're way ahead on Planner. Our economy is doing okay. So GHG came back, which is interesting. Uh, he is accumulating titanium. Yeah. His economy is starting to pull away from ours a little bit, which is scary. There's just nothing valuable here to do, I don't think. So we probably need to figure out a way to develop a little bit. I would love like a mining area type card here. That would be so good for us with alloys in hand. Uh, not really what we're looking for here. We could consider just taking the tapping here. These hate cards are pretty good, and I think tapping is a little bit better than virus at, at this stage in the game. Wow. Toll station, huh? Seems like a pretty bad card in two player. Maybe we just cut the other plant. Because if he, if he plays solar power, we can zap him. Um, let's cut the animal. He did play Mohol, so cutting farming is a consideration, but I'm, I'm, I still think I'm a little afraid of livestock, especially if we get our energy game going. Um, so we'd like for him to play an ocean now. I think we're just going to keep this. Let me double check the card counts. Okay, so even if he keeps all of them, he will be at 10, and we're going first next gen. So we're okay on planner. Let's just take the tapping. It's up to eight. He took two cards. Yeah, he took two cards and we took one. Wow, and he's just passing. Okay. Wait. Yeah. I want to play Space Mirror, but um, we don't have more power. Boy, taking that nuke power might have been a not taking that nuke power might have been a mistake. Just kidding. All right, now we can play both of these. And if he steals our power, we can steal his bag. What an insane top deck. We're losing a little bit of value by not getting our space station down earlier. I'm actually tempted to not use steel here. Um, hired raiders certainly become scarier. But we could develop alloys next gen. Let's maybe let's do that. Okay. I think this is fine. Problem is we might be in a situation where we're forced to take planner. Which is a little scary. Um, I think we're okay to pass him this power because we can zap it. And we have a uh, great dam coming on soon. Let's take, these are both scary insects and green, greenhouses doesn't scare me as much in a two player game. So let's, uh, let's get insects out of there. Maybe greenhouses even comes back, which would be kind of cool. Um, uh, but he's at eight. So for him to take planner with no card draw he would still just have to take four cards and then four cards so maybe it's silly to, to worry about planner we're probably going to take two cards from this draft anyway so we could um just draw our third card oh okay well with the amount of titanium i know we just took insects so protected valley is sort of tempting it's kind of damned if you do damned if you don't here because uh i i think this is better because we've got like the discount set up for it and he has seven titanium, but he is. This is going to be a good protected valley for him. But um, let's take the convoy off the board. Oh, and there's greenhouses. Okay. So he took the power. That's probably a good sign. 
My understanding, Anthracite, of why the, so few of the top 20 play three-player is because through the vast, through most of the history of this game, there just weren't enough good players, so it was just hard to find three good players. All right, we got to think about this, guys. Um, I think it's fine to keep three here. If we keep three, we're at 20. Alloys puts us at 11, and then that's still enough to play Ore Processor for 13 minus 9 for 4. So we'd still have 11 minus 4. We'd have 6, which is exactly enough to tap and draw a card. So, yeah, this might be greedy. Let's do it. Maybe, maybe it's not smart to go Greenhouses, Insects, when I'm going to slam the slam the oxygen. So oh, I'm trying to decide if we play around sabotage right now. Or if we need to take planner. Crap, this is a hard gen. Um, I'll just ask him. Uh, how would he... So for him to take planner, he would have to have one of the draw two cards. Uh, do we need to take planner? This is really hard. <sighs> Let's just do this. Let's just stall it. Oh, we got investment loan. That's pretty awesome. You think my streams have showed that three player still has very high skill cap? Oh, absolutely. I, every time I start my stream, I'm like confident. I'm like, yeah, I'm excited. I feel like, you know, I'm like a good player. I feel like there's a good chance that I'm going to win. And then after I stream, I'm like, oh my God, I feel like I learned so much that game or like I made so many poor decisions that Filter was able to help me figure out. Like, I, st I still personally feel like I have a, a good a good chunk of time before I like consider myself a master of this game, whatever that means. Um, especially because so many of these three player games have been very short and very intense. I feel like the bulk of the games I've streamed on this channel have, have been like 11 or more generations. And I think that's because for most of the stream, we're usually not playing against two good opponents. It's usually just one good opponent. Um, but now that the stream has gotten bigger, it's like, there's so many good players that are in my chat, and it's just easy easier to get a game. Okay, he's not taking planner. So wait, alloys puts us at nine. Nine minus uh So this puts us at nine, and then, uh, yeah, this costs four. Okay. And if we do that, we're committing to playing these two cards minimum and maybe energy tapping. Do we need to play alloys? I don't even know if we need to play alloys. Oh, this is hard. Might as well, I think. Let's go for it. Yeah, Al Allies was a good choice because we're making one titanium each gen. We're putting our. S that could have hurt us if uh, if he stalled. Yeah, maybe. Um... What did he just do? Dev center. Okay. 
I think what he's gonna do is uh, he might stall us and play a consortium. Gah, he has one power tag already. Oh. Well, that's a, that is a, that is a turn. Now he's out of money, so he can't consortium us. But he uh, he's gonna be doing a lot of work on that heat now. Oh, but we can quantum hit. Or oh, actually, that's that's actually perfect. Okay, okay. Um, because if he has a bumper, we just turn it off. Those energy hate cards are are killer. Um, all right, so planner, we're still totally fine. Builder, we have a slight edge. Um, yeah, but didn't we cut splitting? I think we cut splitting. Or am I, was that last game? Oh god, they're already blurring together. That's not a good sign. I don't know if we, we probably don't need to stall next gen. We could consider just using our action and then playing the ocean up on the steel. Choosing fusion power and the other energy tag is a, is a mistake. Should have kept convoy. He has five, he already has five tags. This is uh we have four tags. Five player over the board had heat trappers both tapping and power consortium. <laughs> so would have played lunar beam. That's amazing. I think we are gonna keep this beam. I think is this beam any good? Are we are we playing this beam? We do have two multipliers, I, I guess. Stinks to pass CEOs. Expansion board where Energizer is a milestone. Oh my god, I would just I would just get up and leave the table. All right, so we don't have our fifth science tag, which is really sad. There are a lot of juicy plant cards. I feel like it's not worth it to invest that much money in those plant cards. So I think we're just gonna keep these. Really wanna draw that card though. The, the benefit of this is even if he doesn't have a bumper, um, it really screws up his heat production. It's nice to have uh, multiples of four here and we, we ruin that, which is good. And we're totally in the driver's seat on planner now. Sadly, that was not a good builder draft. So if we lose builder, do we have any other outs? Maybe terraformer, although this isn't a great terraformer hand yet. Wow, that's a sick pickup. Oh my god, that even turns on mass converter. We could just play this. Let's see what he does. It's like awkward to play that uh, viral now, but we now have um, three microbe tags, four microbe tags. We're gonna get some worms value this game. Hmm, that hurts. I don't know, we might take Terraformer. We might take Terraformer after all with our um with our bumper. Okay, so he's done. Double check this again. We're great on planner, builders, whatever. So, uh, awards don't really matter quite yet. So let's, I think let's develop the mass converter.
And then um, we'll hold off. on. We could play Convoy now, obviously, and uh, take the, um, the steel. But I think what we'll do is we'll open with um, Space Station with our two Titanium and pass. And then we can and then use our action. Oh, I'm taking a lot of time here. We're done, right? Just double checking planner one more time. Yeah, we're good on planner. Okay. Two mass converters in a row feels pretty good. Which board has the energizer milestone? Anthracite. Do we care about mine right now? Uh, uh, gosh. I think we have to cut Geothermal here. Just deny him some building tags. Like, if he gets more steel production, so be it. But I think energy is a little bit more valuable. Um, what? sucks in two player i think just don't care about that okay so we might be we might have to pivot here and just play a little bit of a faster game um his economy is about to go haywire uh, i don't think we can afford to keep geothermal we yeah, who am i kidding we don't need geothermal um, okay, yeah, let's just uh, develop some space stuff here, I think. We don't have a Jovian in play, do we? Um, planner is fine. Scientist is uh, still a little scary. Any urgent business we need to attend to i guess we draw we could draw a card or we could just play our um space station maybe that's fine his economy is gonna go nuts he's gonna play mine this gen uh and he's gonna play space elevator Okay. Maybe I shouldn't have given up so easily on Builder. Milestones are eight different tags played, five cards of the requirements, six energy production. That three. Oh, I've played on the board one time. Those milestones seemed a lot easier to me. Sorry, what did he just do? Dev Center. Okay. We want this steel right now. No, I think we want the card. Let's just do this. Now, now we have to. If he passes here, we have to take planner. Even without preludes, anthracite. I feel like those milestones are just a lot easier on that board than on the base board. Okay, so we have to take planner. Um, but we can draw first. Acquired company. Ooh, convoy. Do we care about playing this? I don't think so. Get the heat rolling. I don't know. I might wait in case we find media group or error breaking and just save the cash. Maybe that's better. I don't think we need to play Great Dam or any of this other stuff. Uh, I don't think we play the the Earth tag. I don't think we care about this. So let's yeah, let's figure out how to get to Terraformer.
ecologist specialist is ridiculous. Ecologist is also broken. Oh my god. Okay. Well, we have to take TG. Gosh, we have no way to make titanium though. This is really sad. Plants are losing value pretty quickly. Let's cut. Oh, actually we could take this for terraformer. We've got to figure out a way to get a Jovian in play. I really wish we had the um, the building tag Jovian. He used a bunch of the steam tricks fluidly on stream. He could have just learned them all though by playing like a billion games in a short amount of time, right? So the question is, can we get to Terraformer before he takes two milestones? And the answer seems like it's going to be yes. At some point we consider playing this for the oceans. I, I really don't like that play because it's so expensive, but um, it would let us develop beam I don't know, this is a game where we might lose because we're just underdeveloped. Oh, you saw him using them on the first day? That's fair. He, he, he seems like he's pretty cagey when people ask <laughs> who, his, uh, who his main is. Oh, I'm, wor I'm worried about this game. Um... I'm glad that he doesn't have like a giant titanium monopoly, but we really need to, we really need to make more money. I, I guess um, the power is helping a lot. What do we draw? Come on, aquifer pumping? No, that's not it. Now I can't, uh, I can't, <laughs> I can't type anymore. The chat's broken, so that's, that's cool. But I passed along your message, Anthracite. He seems today is the last day. Let's, uh, let's try this. Maybe this will fix chat. Okay, what's going on here? Oh, anti-grav? I think it's over now, folks. Oh, and there's media group too. Oh, that's too bad. All 
All right, here we go. He's got the better cards. Let's see if we can uh, sprint this game to a conclusion. We thankfully are sitting on some Mega Jovians, which I feel like he will never let come our way, even though he doesn't know we have them. I just think he's going to take them. Um, we can heat bump here. It's fine. He doesn't have one. To oh, that was stupid. He has a heat bump. Oh, well. I should have should have thought about that a little longer. Uh, so, actually, can we ever get to Builder? I know I've asked that already, but that's tag number four, or five and number six. It's not completely out of the question. I guess we'll, uh, we'll do our best. We will do our best. There's the space elevator. Um, worms, insects, not doing it for us right now. Um, the worst part about two player is looking at your hand on Gen 5, 7 and knowing you have absolutely no chance of winning. <laughs> yeah, I think there's a like a 95% chance we've lost the game now, but um, I'm going to try to do whatever we can to influence the tempo of this game in our favor. Awards are looking pretty hopeless, too. The way we do it is if uh, if we somehow manage to take um, Builder and Terraformer... Now, e even then, even if we get all three milestones, uh, I think we're still losing. Um, but, but we'll see. I don't know. We're making 14 energy, so uh, ho hopefully... We're getting 2 TR for sure. There's no... no well, we all saw what happened last game. He absolutely act he could catch us in... in uh, in terraformer although he doesn't quite have enough titanium and cards i think to do that so um i think we're probably pretty safe on terraformer we just uh we just have to figure out if we can close builder or not and the answer is probably no but um it really it, it depends okay so there's number six depends if it, yeah okay he's got it gg let's take as many of these points as we can And just see how it ends up. Ants, domed crater, immigration shuttles, business network. Um, I'm not super excited about any of these cards. I don't know if the plants are, are going to come to fruition this game. Dome crater is a massive investment. Um, we probably have to cut this from him with his steel situation. Uh, although business network is is very frightening. Let's cut the crater. He's gonna get business network, which which stinks, but um, asteroid mining consortium. Boy, would I like to play that card. That would fix so many of our problems. Actually, what am I talking about? This steelworks is is kind of nuts. Let's just take the steelworks. We're going to just end this as fast as we, as humanly possible. Uh, we can cut the shuttles, I think. You going to play more weekday streams? <laughs> yeah, you you kind of figured out why I haven't been streaming. And when I very when I first started, I was streaming on four night or two nights and and the weekends, but um uh, it does seem like most of my viewers are uh, in Europe, so it just doesn't make a whole lot of sense, but I don't know. I, I'm pretty sure Aspirin, Aspirin's American, Messenger's American, so I, I, you're American too, right? If I if I'm remembering correctly. Um, sorry, I'm trying to figure out if I want to take EOS here. I, yeah, I don't know. Nah, I don't think so. 
Um, oh, NYC? Did we talk about this? I lived in NYC for four years. Oh, God. Oh, that sucks. Oh, I want it. Oh, we could have played AMC. Mayor, Gardener. Okay, he's going to take Builder, so let's let's get to Terraformer, yeah. Whatever. We don't. I don't think we need to slow play here. Let's make sure we get the Milestone. God, that Vesta though. If we had if we had played Vesta into um if we had played Vesta into what's it called? Asteroid Mining Consortium. That would have been so nice. Probably not enough to change the game, but I don't know. Uh Williamsburg. I am not from the West Coast. I've only been on the West Coast for for actually under a year now. I'm a pretty fresh transplant from New York City. I actually grew up in the Midwest. I grew up in uh, the great state of Kansas. Probably one of the reason I uh, am pretty good at games is because I grew up in Kansas. There's not a whole lot to do there, so I played a lot of games as a child. Um, well, now I do kind of want to stall a little bit. Um, Midwestern original here as well. Oh, I sound like it. Um, it's funny because I feel like Midwesterners just don't have accents, but maybe that's because I'm from the Midwest. It just feels like there's no like defining characteristic of a Midwestern accent. Whereas, like, someone from California or the South or, like, the North, like, Minnesota, like, you can really pick out the accents. Um... Can we get a greenery some? Oh, th wait, 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 this would do it. That itself defines it. Yeah, the neutralness. Virus. What? What? Why virus? Can he? Yeah, he can't take it. Okay, this is fine. You were in the Bay Area. You lived in CA for two years, but moved back to NYC a couple years ago. Which do you prefer? I have to say, I love New York. I love it to death. I am so happy I'm not there in the midst of coronavirus. Not the place I want to be. Uh, okay, so we're doing this. We're terraforming. Beautiful area. But NYC outside of these days just feels like a superior city. Yeah, I absolutely cannot dispute that. Also, the fact that I, I hate cars. I don't like... I mean, going on, like, a road trip is really fun and nice, but um, I love that uh, you don't have to have a car in New York. It's just it's just great. Here, so we don't need to claim Terraformer yet. Can we claim anything here? It's really not looking super good. Being near Napa was fantastic. Gosh, I can imagine, man. Do you... um? Are you a big wine guy? I think we're gonna play this. Uh, do we? If, okay, if we play this Vesta, we could get Consortium, which would suck. But it does let us play Beam and let us let us get our other Jovians going. I'm trying to decide if it's worth it. Um, all right. 
Yeah, there it is. Not driving is much better. Yeah, I totally agree. Um, I love decomposers. I love it to death. I love it with all my heart. But I think um, we are we want to end this game. Just as fast as we as fast as we can, and this gives us two parameters. Yeah, let's take it. We also have it heavily discounted. It just seems it seems like too slow to get the bio tags going this game. Decomposers is so good though with um with the fungus, but Yeah, I want I want to go on a road trip. I got to I actually still don't have a car out here. I've been just delaying the purchase as long as possible, but um I feel like I can't I can't delay that for too much longer. Cuz I, I I do want that freedom to go out onto the open road. So we're gonna just end this game and um and buy Jovians, guys. I think that's the plan. We've got two oceans in hand with the card that we just picked up. Um, if, I honestly think we just take nuke zone and we just we just hustle. If he takes Habs, so be it. Uh, we're 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 pretty much not going plants this game it's been decided uh he's already played virus we don't even have any animals to destroy um well wow he didn't keep decomposers well anthracite the truth is i i don't go i don't really go too many places i live on like literally the same street as my brother so i can just walk to him um, I live a walking distance from my office, which is closed, so I'm just working from home. I live walking distance from the beach. Um, I just order my groceries, and if I want to go visit my friends in, like, East L.A., I just I just hop in an Uber. And, yeah, it's expensive, but um, way less expensive than paying for car insurance and paying the costs of owning a car. But, um, but yeah, I'm, I'm pretty boring in the sense that I, I don't really – oh, my God, Habs came back, too. That's so funny. Um, I just, yeah, I, I feel, I feel like, especially in the pandemic, I just like, I don't need to go anywhere. I kind of have everything I need within, within walking distance. I'm also considering investing in a nice like bicycle. I think that would be kind of fun. Um, do we want to play this decomposers? I think it's too slow. That doesn't even sound like LA. Yeah, I mean, I live way out on the west side. Um, so, I mean, a lot of LA is basically closed to me because I, I just don't, um, I don't go to other parts of LA because it's difficult for me to do so. But I'm fine with that for now. Um, can we have on Thermalist? No, hard no. We might be able to end this by uh, Gen 11, though. No, probably not. Who am I kidding? Um... Wars are so scary. Wait, sorry. Oh, he has a greenery. He has a greenery and a city. Just keep an eye on that. What brought me to LA? Uh, I just wanted a break from New York, and um, I had some friends here who were working at a, a company out here, and they said, do you want to come work for us? And I interviewed and just decided I want to change the pace and live on the other coast, and, uh, and, and here I am. Close to family, which feels good. Well, yeah, close to my brother at least. Uh, are we playing beam now? Sure.
How many... Uh, this Jovian thing just feels like a bait. I mean, we have two multipliers, and we have colony ship. So we have high-scoring cards. Uh, oh, and we have terraforming Ganymede. I, yeah, I guess we just have to focus on getting, like, just those cards out, and that is our, our win condition here. Oof. Okay, that's city number two. Let's take that off the board. In case he wants to get cute and find another city. Uh, all right, heat bump time. So next gen we'll have 16, which is two heat bumps. So if we bump now and he bumps now, the heat's at negative 10. Um, we don't quite have enough to get it there. We have a nuke zone in hand. And a comet it just isn't isn't quite good enough. If we bump the oxygen here, we can't really do anything particularly exciting with it. With the steel, I mean, we're gonna do it regardless. What's the VP count? So he's plus nine on VP. We're plus fifteen on TR. Um. Yeah, I don't know if we can pressure him enough. We'll we'll see we'll see if it's enough. I think the answer is. No, but... The anti-grav made us pivot pretty hard on our strategy. Oh, there's arrow breaking. Oh, it's painful. Does loan do anything for us? Loan gives us 12 cash. It's okay. We could just sell a card too. Just see what he what he does. So many fewer decisions in two player. You think so? I don't know if that's true. Maybe. Satellites. Satellites for how many? It's not the best satellites I've ever seen. Is he almost done? Let's sell the fungus. So the reason we're stalling right now is because um, if if he decides to like go crazy on the heat, I want to be competitive on it with uh, with Nuke Zone. I don't even think it matters though because he's a smart player and he um, he probably if he like all he needs is a plus two ev event in his hand and there's still like flows. There's the consortium makes sense. Um. So he did spend 16 cash on that consortium, and because the game is ending so quickly, kind of, so one of, it's usually pretty dumb to play into consortium the way I did, and it may still have been dumb, but um, the reason we did it is because uh, we're pushing the game so quickly that we can ho hopefully make that a sort of inefficient investment for him. Also, it turned to be mom, and we probably wouldn't have even played it if we uh, if we weren't thinking about playing beam. I think we might take indentured here. I don't think we care too much about land claim. We're gonna need we're gonna need cash to close this game out, and he has media group down already, so uh, that card is ultra ultra good for him. How do I play these twenty five cards most efficiently? Oh man, I want to play training camp. Um, let's cut. Noctis. We could even keep Noctis farming. It's not that great for us, but uh, it's a way to use our steel, and I don't think we have a way to use our steel other than greenhouses, which is looking rather tragic at the moment. I feel like I've been like rushing my decisions a little bit in this game. I haven't been playing maybe as like thoughtfully as I could. I'm just kind of, I'm kind of going on feel, uh, and I feel a great sadness uh, after anti grav, and yeah, it's just we're in pivot mode here. Do we want to keep this Noctis farming? It's 
really not very good. Technically, we could local heat trapping uh, and get us the other four plants, and that would let us at least put a greenery on the board. Yeah, okay, maybe we'll gamble on it. So, I guess we're slow playing here. I guess we'll draw. Pets. I don't, th I don't think we want to play pets. I don't think that really fits. Uh, I think we're not playing a city this game, it looks like. And he probably won't need to play another one since he's got one here he can put greeneries next to. Business network, okay. The big problem here is oceans. I mean, we have a few in our hand, and technically we can make them with Europa. Um, but boy, it sure would be nice to have like a Marineris in hand. So what's your deal, Anthracite? Are you um, are you gonna keep playing two-player games for the sake of like climbing? Because I think it is like indisputably the best way to rank up in the ladder. Or are you just gonna focus on playing three-player? So he's playing greeneries now. Do we need to drop a nuke zone? Not yet. Let's play this. And then I think we heat trapping for the greenery. How many plants does he have? Zero plants, okay. So we need to dodge an oxygen bump here and then we're, uh, we're okay. Eighty to ninety percent three player games. You've playing some two player to hop into the top twenty. Yeah, yeah, totally. I mean, if we sap five of our heat, we lose a heat bump, but we take the last oxygen bump. So I'm inclined to say it's worth it. Let's take those four plants. You prefer to play mostly three player against strong players that don't quit. Well. I feel like if, if if there's one good thing my stream has done is it's uh, gathered a group of strong players to play three-player games. So um, I think what I need to do is make a Discord channel so we can have like an offline community for you guys or for, for us to um, at least ha well, have a place to chill and like get to know each other and whatever, um, but also have like t to be able to hit each other up um, to schedule games and stuff. Because I'm sure a lot of you obviously want to play each other whether or not I'm streaming, so... Um, maybe I'll try to get that figured out by the, by the weekend when I'm streaming next. That would be great. Cool. All right. Well, I'm glad I have your endorsement there. Get that going. Nitrogen rich. Okay. Um, it's pretty good. Thankfully the plants aren't scoring too many more points this game. I suppose we could play research. Um, I don't know what to do. We want to play research here. Sure. Oh, wow. Earth catapult. Is it too late for earth catapult? Probably not, right? Now I feel kind of dumb about keeping decom. I don't know, do I? Yeah, let's play Earth Cat. 
And then we can play greenhouses, I guess. Greenhouses is only worth two plants. Eh. I was gonna say we could play greenhouses into med lab for the ex for the extra. Oh man. For the extra money production. Sometimes I don't finish my thoughts. Um, well, one of my main complaints is some of the streams is just the streamer steamrolling weak opponents. Yeah, I feel like we were doing that for a while before we established this community of like good players. And now I feel like every time I stream, it's like stressful because uh, y'all are good. Let's just play the med lab, I think. Funny moments when the streamer spends a couple minutes planning what their opponents could do, but the opponents are nowhere near skilled enough to implement that plan. <laughs> That's really funny. But a great group of players that stream, so fun to watch. Yeah, well, I'm glad you guys are enjoying it. It's It's been really fun, and I feel really privileged that um Filter has been a big part of it, because I have learned, I've grown so much as a player just watching Filter uh, and playing with Filter. Um, he's, he's, oh my gosh, 32 heat. Are we about to bow out of this gen? That's four heat bumps. I don't know. Yeah, maybe, uh... Maybe we're done. Game's not gonna end. There's still all these oceans left. Uh, but yeah, filter filter is awesome, and I feel like having another strong player... Uh, having like the two of us be able to talk through our decisions. I'm sure to some people it's maddening because we take so much time talking through things. But for others, I think uh, people get super hype hyped about it. Wow. Um, I can't decide if it's conference or permafrost. I guess we could we could take yeah no no it's always permafrost. Who am I kidding? Um. And the goal is just to end this game as fast as possible. If he wants to play AI Central, like, go for it. Uh, small animals? Probably don't care about that. Symbiotic fungus? Probably don't care about that. Wow, he took AI. Okay. Well, I think we'll take. I think we'll take conference. Will we take conference? What's he, what, what's getting funded this game? Definitely taking that. Maybe we don't take conference. It is a steel dump if we choose to use our energy. We can take it. We can, we can take it. Small animals. I don't think we care. Uh, it's yeah, it's okay. I I'm hoping that maximum it draws four more cards. If we let this game two more generations, we have we have really failed. Um, let's uh let's zap some of his plants. I think.
Physics complex, okay. That's, uh, I think that's... Wait, what? He has no energy. Did he use it? Wait, wait, wait. He has three on it? When did he play physics complex? Oh, I'm losing my mind. Um... If we make an ocean now, hmm, let's let's take some titanium, I think. Uh, and then the question, I'm trying to figure out how we convert another greenery. If we make an ocean, we get two more plants, and we can make an ocean with the, the card that we just drew. I don't think he has demos. I think this is fine to play. Um, I guess we could play greenhouses. It's fine. We might lose the plants, but uh, we didn't really have a choice there. You should hire someone to distract me when we play next. <laughs> yeah, I, uh, I realize my, my focus maybe has dipped a little bit, but uh, I don't know. I feel like there's not a ton to think about here. Like, our plan is just, oh, landlord, okay. Our plan is just end, end the game. Scientist, yeah. Probably should have taken the card there. Maybe. I don't know. It's an awkward situation we're in because, like, we we still have big Jovians to play, but we also just need to figure out how to end the end the game. Uh, we we could play Convoy next into another greenery. And then we could take the card. Or we could take more plants. Well, we're always going here, I think. Okay. Do we want the card? Do we want the steel? Or do we want two more plants? Maybe we want two more plants for the sake of landlord. Probably should have played herbivores, huh? Actually, I don't know if herbivores is correct, because again, that doesn't really fit our plan of... Uh, Ending the game slash playing Jovians. So can we take a bump now? Maybe. If we take a bump... Hmm. We just have to. And if he ha he doesn't have Demos, um, but he could have giant. We could have just played right into his giant asteroid thing. The one that steals four plants and gives four titanium and has two heat bumps. Wow, he doesn't have it. That's cool. All right, so nu <clears throat> excuse me. Where to put this nuke zone? I guess we're taking two more plants, huh? Catching up, catching up on that landlord.
sadly we 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 can't end it this gen. I think we always knew that was happening, but um. But next gen we're in good shape. We won't, but we want to. There's a lot of cards we want to play. Too too many, in fact. We are considerably ahead on TR. And we're, I don't know, this, this is this is more interesting than I'm giving it credit for. I, I still don't feel great about it, but uh, we're putting some pressure on. So we, we're commit, we, we want to spend, um, 33 plus 18 is uh, 51, right? 51 plus 27. What is that? Uh, yeah, he can just not end it, and he can put us in a, in a tough position. It's, we might be able to get all this out with the help of indentured and investment loan. We might be able to play these big four cards. Which makes me feel extra dumb about keeping conference, but... Oh, man. And we're now, um... We're gonna have 23 heat next gen. So we're one off, which is really bad. We have no way to get more heat right now, which is... Which is... Oh, that's just so sad. He's also gonna have a, like, open field to just fund Thermalist if he wants to. How many Jovians do I have already? Only two in play. But we have two. So these are these are worth four apiece if we play both. Uh, and then plus TG, they're worth five apiece. And I think the reason I... I may have, like, tunnel vision too hard on the Jovians. But it's it's hard to um, not do that in a... Like, I, I first of all, I really don't like Jovians in 3-player. I think they're pretty weak. But in 2-player, they're obviously quite strong, especially when you have both of the multipliers and a lot of space dis discounts. So that's kind of why uh, it went down this path. So we could consider using the steel. I think we can start selling some cards here. Just see what uh, what he's doing here. Because he, he very much has the power to end this game. Um, and maybe he just took some time to count. He, he could just be winning right now. Oh, wait, what did he do? Thermalist, okay. Makes sense. Nothing we can do about that. Um... Let's just keep selling cards. How many cards does he has? He only has 10 cards. Eh, I don't know. What other oceans can we play? None. So next gen, we probably open with double heat bump. Giant ice? No, actually, that wouldn't be... We, we basically can't take any more cards. I think I think we're just done uh, done with cards, unless um, he wants to just keep not ending the game. In which case, if we, if we... Maybe we take, like, Lava Flows or something. Maybe that's one card that we're excited about. And uh, the reason we're, we're doing this is because I, I don't think stalling is going to matter too much in this final gen. We're only one back on Landlord. I 
really don't think he can end this. He'd have to have media archives, right? There have been 17 events played. We're going to have a lot of money next gen. We're going to have 53 plus 13. We're going to have 66 plus 9 plus 8, basically. I think we have enough to play all of our big cards, and that's awesome. Trying to decide if we want to take steel. So next gen, we're going to have 23. Uh, he's going to win Thermalist probably pretty handily. Yeah, super duper handily. So, um, yeah, I think we take the steel, right? Because then we're at a 19. 10 plus 9, yeah. It's fine. Now we're done, okay. He has put us in a little bit of a pickle here. Yeah, with, with the Jovian strat. Okay. Demos. Demos does it. I mean, Demos takes care of the heat in a, in a pretty good way for us. Um, Io is just too, way, 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 way too slow. And then we just gotta find, uh, find an ocean. Earth office. Earth office is, 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 uh, Earth office is worth it. It saves us, it saves us quite a bit. But we didn't find an ocean. Um, we're not going to keep methane. We can't afford it. We'll keep these, though. Demos heat bump takes those, uh, ensures we get all of the, um, all of the things, which I like. It hit six plants, which is quite good. But yeah, the problem is oceans. We need two of them. Just real bad. Man, and we threw away um we threw away aqua for pumping. It probably would have been smart to keep aqua for pumping and just use all the steel we were generating for those oceans. That might have been enough to win to win the game. Or come closer to winning than whatever's going to happen here. It's fine to draw. If we draw Marineris, oh my gosh, I would scream. Oh, man. That would have been so good for us. Ganymede Colony is a tile. I think the reason we do it, Anthracite, is because, um, I mean, we've identified that he boxes us out of, of the heat track effectively, so, like, it guarantees that we get the rest of the heat bumps. We only had the ability to take three heat bumps of our own heat there, um, so it just it just saves us from stand having to standard a heat bump, so, I don't know, M maybe you're right. I, d I do like getting all those all those points, though. Demos is the only way we get all of those points. And now he just has, like, he's winning Thermalist in a landslide, but it's it's kind of a waste. Do 
Problem is I know he won't play an ocean. Well, I'm saying if it's the only way we control the end of a game with um with heat. I I, I did it. I did it expecting to be able to end the game this gen. I guess is is what I'm what I'm getting at. Okay, so if we okay, if we play this, it costs 15. Well, but now okay, now I'm trying to figure out if we play this it's 15. 15 plus 12 for one ocean is um 15 plus 12 is 27, and then, yeah. Yeah, I, I guess. I, I might have just panicked, and um, I wonder if there's a line where we just take AI instead back there. I think I maybe like panicked a little bit. He's just gonna he's gonna outscore us though, even with our Jovian threat. Uh yeah. This really is too bad. The reason I passed AI there um, is because I expected to be able to end the end the game in two gens, and I just really, um, I just didn't calculate the oceans thoroughly enough. We probably should have played. Um, we probably should have made an ocean last gen with this thing. Um, Yeah, I, I just don't know how, uh, I don't know. I mean, your analysis is, is correct. Like, obviously, AI puts you in such a strong position. But um, let, let's not forget he has anti-grav there. I get, my thinking was, like, let's let's make him spend 21 cash on AI Central. Um, and let's make sure he only gets two, two gens of value out of it. Because paying that much for AI... Yeah, I don't know. I, I probably could have taken AI... And then he would have maybe taken conference. I just really wanted that ocean because I thought it would be enough to just push it. Yeah. In short, I picked the line I thought had the greatest chance. And I felt like baiting him into AI might have been the winning line. Um, I just haven't, I just didn't execute it very well. It is still a point, yeah. The reverse psychology plays. Yeah, I'm trying. I have I I have to make the decision if it's worth it to end this game. It feels so bad to do that. Because then we're only playing this card is worth three points. We play the ocean. I guess the ocean gives us another, like, we'd have to spend 30 on oceans, basically. 12 from the action and 18 from a standard project, and we would get four back. So, like, let's assume that that costs 26. So we have, um, we effectively have, 43, 53, 53, 61 cash. This would cost 19. 
um, which puts us at 52. We would then spend 30 on the oceans, which puts us at 22. We get four back. We have 26. Um, and then we can either play Ganymede Colony or sell one. We could play Ganymede Colony that's high on Landlord. Or we could... Um, Yeah, or we could sell another card and play. Uh, yeah, okay, I guess we got to do the math. Um, 57, 60, 61, 71. Uh, oh, we funded minor. So 71 plus 7 is uh, 78. And he has 31, 36, 36 plus 15 is 51, 51 plus 2 is 53, plus 2 is 55, plus 27. 55 plus 27, what is that? 82 was what did I say set so it's 71 to 82 so we're down by nine we're, we're not winning this game if it, if it goes again we just there's no like he outscores us the longer this game goes on so I think we have to end no matter what Did you track everything I just said there, Anthracite? I should have written it down and I didn't. And Landlord's probably not gonna matter. I think he gets to another tile. Pretty interesting game. If I had done a little bit of deeper calculation, um, now he's selling stuff. 78 for me? Okay. Oh, I forgot to count the titanium. What a sad alloy is this game, huh? <laughs> I mean, we got value out of it from our, our bumpers. Can I get water and interstellar? No, I don't think so. So we so we have to spend thir so we spend 30 on oceans and that puts us at 16, but we get four back and that puts us at 20. So we we then with our 20 cash. Yeah, we can't even get terraforming Ganymede. We have to pick Ganymede colony or colony ship. They're they're the same though. I don't think there's any way to get both. Oh, and I miscounted too because uh, this effectively costs 16. Yeah. We really want him to, to make the, the ocean, but he's not going to. Yeah, but we can't let the game go another though. So which one of these is better? Does it matter? I don't, I guess we play uh...
Yeah. I don't know. I just feel like... I know, like, like, yeah. Uh, terraforming Ganymede would have been seven points. So we had 11 points in our hand. So the question we have to ask our, ourselves is, and he, he just played Media Archives. Um, I don't know. I might have to go back and uh, and analyze this a little bit more because basically the, the calculation is we're sitting on we're we're sitting on eleven points right there right with terraforming Ganymede and colony ship and um, I don't think I think he can outscore eleven points next gen with his with his setup with all of his money because like he has way more capital than us um, he has an incredible amount of draw he has a physics complex like. Uh, you, you have to end it there, I think. Uh, and it's painful to, um... It's painful to do it that way, but... But, you know what? I'm happy this guy's ending on a win. Uh, he deserves to ride out into the sunset a champion. Because, um... We beat, we beat him. We, we took a game from him, and uh, I feel good about that game. And he got anti-grab early this game, so he got his he got his card. And um, I'm not going anywhere. You guys will you still have me on the on the weekend. Less than ten percent chance. Yeah, you're right. It could have been fun. I kept it interesting. We kept it close. He wants to play another one. Oh. Mm. Close. I can't, uh... I can't, I can't chat. Um, sorry, man, I can't chat. Close. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, yeah, I don't know. That was a really hard decision. I just really felt we couldn't uh, overcome his uh, scaling advantage for 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 another gen. Um, you might be right though, and we'll never know. We'll just never know. We're just gonna have to end it on a tie. Ah. Hang on, I got I gotta go pop over to his stream. Uh how do I how do I talk with him? Uh, come on, whispers. What's going on? Oh, 